in the realm of American cinema, a particular film stands as a testament to the human experience during a tumultuous era. The Deer Hunter, released in 1978, directed by Michael Cimino, navigates the lives of three working-class friends from Pennsylvania whose bonds are tested by the crucible of the Vietnam War. The movie, known for its gritty portrayal of the psychological toll of war, raises poignant questions about friendship, resilience, and the fragility of the human spirit. Have you ever found yourself reflecting on a personal story influenced by the profound narrative of the deer hunter? Perhaps there's a cherished memory associated with the film that has lingered in your mind. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. As we delve into the impact of this cinematic gem, we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to the deer hunter. Your unique perspective adds depth to the collective appreciation of this influential work. The Deer Hunter, directed by Michael Cimino in 1978, revolves around a group of friends from a small industrial town in Pennsylvania. The film explores the impact of the Vietnam War on their lives, both during and after the conflict. The narrative begins with a pre-war depiction of their tight-knit community, focusing on their relationships and values. As the characters head off to serve in Vietnam, the film shifts its tone dramatically, depicting the harrowing experiences they endure as prisoners of war. The narrative then follows their return home, revealing the profound psychological and emotional scars left by the war. Notable characters include Michael, played by Robert De Niro, who becomes the focal point of the story, showcasing the effects of trauma on an individual's psyche. The film's unique style lies in its portrayal of the war's brutal realities and its exploration of the lasting consequences on the characters' lives. The Deer Hunter had a significant impact on popular culture, sparking discussions on the human cost of war and earning critical acclaim for its powerful performances and portrayal of the Vietnam War's aftermath. Its unflinching depiction of the psychological toll of war remains a hallmark of the film, resonating with audiences for its stark realism and emotional depth. Jodie Foster holds The Deer Hunter in high regard, citing it as her favorite film. Christopher Walken's intense portrayal during the Russian roulette scene stemmed from personal memories of a traumatic summer camp experience, channeling those emotions into the character's sense of betrayal and isolation. Set across 1967, 1968, and 1975, the film navigates through different periods, capturing the impact of the Vietnam War on a group of friends from a small Pennsylvania town. The story delves into their lives before, during, and after the conflict, exploring the profound psychological toll and emotional scars left by the war. Robert De Niro, sharing in a tribute, revealed a poignant moment from the film, a scene between Michael and Stephen at the hospital that deeply moved him, leading to tears. This emotional depth mirrored the intense commitment behind the scenes. Director Michael Cimino invested six months in filming and another five months meticulously crafting the soundtrack, driven by a passion for leveraging Dolby stereo technology to its utmost. He immersed himself in the process, even taking the composer, Stanley Myers, to the locations to synchronize the sounds of war with the film's visuals, aiming for a chillingly authentic experience. This marked Cimino's inaugural use of Dolby noise reduction, an innovation he believed shattered barriers between the audience and the film, heightening immersion and intensity through sound density. The relentless dedication to detail in both emotion and technical craft defines the compelling essence of this film. Robert De Niro found this movie to be his most physically demanding work. Scenes were all shot on location, no sound stages used. There's a moment where George D. Zunza flubs a line, causing some of the actors to break character and laugh. That's the real deal behind the scenes of this film, showcasing the challenges and genuine moments that happen during filming. The authentic slapping in the Russian roulette scenes added raw realism, intensifying the actors' emotions. It's a controversial point in a film criticized for portraying the North Vietnamese in a one-sided manner. Director Michael Cimino defended this, emphasizing the non-political, non-posturing nature of his work. He even cited news clippings confirming the use of Russian roulette during the war. Interestingly, Roy Shader was initially set for a role, but left due to creative differences, a move that tied him back to another famous film of the time. The Deer Hunter had its share of behind-the-scenes shifts and contentious portrayals, adding layers to its production story. 
John Wayne's final public appearance took an unexpected turn when he presented an Oscar to a movie he didn't quite favor the deer hunter. It painted a starkly different picture of the Vietnam War compared to Wayne's own film, The Green Berets. This divergence in perspectives made Wayne's involvement in the award presentation quite intriguing. Meanwhile, behind the scenes, the wedding sequence in The Deer Hunter held an unforeseen surprise. Director Michael Cimino urged extras to make the festivities as genuine as possible, even asking them to bring wrapped gifts as props. But here's the twist. The extras wrapped real gifts instead of the instructed empty boxes, leading to an unexpected authenticity on set. Interestingly, during filming, Christopher Walken's fear of fast driving clashed with his character's behavior. In a scene where his character encourages speeding, Walken's personal phobia added an unexpected layer to the performance, showing the actor's divergence from his character's persona. These intriguing off-screen incidents within the production of The Deer Hunter add a fascinating layer to the movie's legacy, showcasing unexpected twists both in front of and behind the camera. U.S. Steel's Cleveland Mill played a crucial role in the movie, allowing filming on its premises only after a hefty $5 million insurance policy was secured. This mill setting became a backdrop for pivotal scenes, showcasing the intricacies of the characters' lives. The studio faced a hurdle when John Cazale, a key actor, was deemed uninsurable. Robert De Niro stepped in, providing the necessary funds for Cazale's insurance, Sadly, Cazale passed away shortly after the movie's completion, leaving a poignant mark on the film's production. Christopher Walken's portrayal of his character's haunting emptiness had an unexpected method behind it. He sustained himself solely on water, rice, and bananas, cultivating the hollow look that became integral to his character's demeanor throughout the film. These behind-the-scenes insights reveal the challenges and unique approaches taken in the making of this impactful movie, shedding light on the dedication and hurdles faced by the cast and crew. As our cinematic journey draws to a close, I encourage you to take a quiet moment and delve into the profound emotional landscape painted by the 1978 classic we've been exploring. The Deer Hunter isn't just a film, it's a poignant reflection of friendship, resilience, and the haunting echoes of human experiences in the face of adversity. Perhaps it stirred echoes of your own bonds, moments of strength, or provoked contemplation about the intricacies of life's trials. What scenes resonated with you the most? Was it the camaraderie amidst adversity, the striking portrayal of human resilience, or the poignant exploration of post-war impact on individuals' lives? Your thoughts, memories, and reflections are the threads that weave the tapestry of this timeless masterpiece. Feel free to share your musings, anecdotes, or even the emotions that stirred within you during this cinematic voyage. Your unique perspective adds depth and richness to the collective experience of this impactful narrative. Thank you for taking this reflective journey with us. Your presence and insights have added immeasurable value. Until we embark on our next exploration together, may the echoes of the Deer Hunter's poignant storytelling linger within, shaping our understanding of the human spirit.